for Texas in, of Comsys. Good morning, Jim. Good morning, Tony. How are you? I'm doing great. Um, Jim, you're going to be one of the featured speakers this morning. What are you going to be talking about as far as trends uh, in the market? Well, obviously, Tony, we're in the staffing business, so employment is a key indicator for us. So we'll be sharing some of what we see in the market in terms of national and local employment trends, which industries are hiring, as well as some of the anecdotal things that we see client by client in terms of salary reductions, layoffs, where, where people are hiring, and what our customers are saying they're going to be doing from a growth or a staffing standpoint. On the, uh, do you are, the presentation you're presenting today? Are you looking only at the local level or national? -wide? Well, it's a little bit of both. So I think anytime you look at the local markets, you have to compare them to regional and national to understand the dynamics of a local marketplace. And certainly, what we see here in Austin and in Texas is still a stronger market than across the country, which is good since I'm responsible for Texas. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you for being here this morning. We look forward to your presentation. Well, thanks for having us. With me is Scott Gody, the Senior Vice President Marketing with Azilios. Azilios does remote managed services for Exchange and SharePoint and Active Directory. And uh, we've brought down our Director of Architecture, Lee Dumas. He's going to be talking about a fairly unique case study we have with um, one of the local Texas companies uh, by the name of Alcon, a uh, pharmaceutical healthcare provider. And we're going to talk about how we've helped them migrate their systems, their 19,000 users uh, from Exchange 2003 up to Exchange 2007, uh, drastically reduce the number of servers through virtualization and really uh, automate and, and uh, reduce costs around their email system. From, from the perspective of CFO, a Chief Financial Officer, uh, is cost saving one of the key driving points in, their in everyone's business today? Absolutely. The more companies we talk about, especially in this day and age, it's all about uh, making sure your security is high, uh, making sure the ROI of any system, of any IT system you're going to buy is as high as possible and that the costs come down in a way that doesn't uh, affect the way you do business, but really affects your bottom line in, in a positive way. So uh, we actually just merged with uh, another company based in Charlotte. So we've doubled the size of our customer base, doubled the size of our employees. And we've got two network operation centers in Charlotte and in Seattle. Uh, we've got a host of SharePoint and Active Directory and Exchange experts sitting there in those opera operation centers. And we'd plug a little piece of software onto any corporate environment that pushes all kinds of data about those servers back to our, our Knox in Seattle Charlotte, and we make Exchange sing. We make uh, the, the keep 99.9 .9 or, or greater uptime for those companies, make sure their security is high, make sure their email's running, and they can pretty much forget about email. It works for them, and everybody's happy. Thank you for being a feature presenter this morning, and uh, we look for more things from Azaleos. Thank you. Thanks a lot. With me is Glenn Norum, the chairman of the board with EduCorp Training and Consulting. Good morning. Morning. How are you, Tony? Thank you guys for being a sponsor at this event, and thank you guys for inviting Mr. Pike Power, who's going to be speaking in a few minutes. Um, can you tell us a little bit more about EduCorp and your vision about the company? Uh, EduCorp is a, uh, a leading and recognized leader in the IT skills training world. Uh, we've been in existence for over 10 years, uh, IBM offering IBM, HP, Sun, Solaris, uh, AIX training, Microsoft certifications, Cisco certifications, uh, and we do that here in Texas and around the world for those customers. We also do uh, consulting services, uh, traditionally in the storage and disaster recovery area. Uh, today we're going to be announcing a, uh, a relationship, a teaming agreement with uh, Total Solutions Group. Uh, you may know them, fairly famous in the consulting world, to expand our professional teams, to expand our resources, our capabilities to the benefit of our customers. And so we'll be doing some, some more consulting during this, uh, th during this time. What are some of the things that you're seeing in the market and uh, how is that relating to your company and your growth? Well, it's, I would say it's both the worst of times and the best of times in the IT business. Uh, as many people know, uh, there's been a lot of dismissals, a lot of, uh, of cost uh, consciousness, uh, cost reductions across corporate uh, 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 landscape, and that hurts IT as well as every other uh, part of the, of, of the uh, corporations. But what we have found is during this period of time, the, uh, the IT staff goes back and want to increase their certifications. Uh, they're doing more work. Uh, those remaining uh, workers and those that are laid off want to enhance their skills. So we see training as a vital piece of, of that recovery process. Additionally, as the recession, as we come out of this on the recovery side, uh, we always see uh, that expansion first. Uh, companies cannot respond to, their, to that growth and they reach outside for 
additional training additional skills additional staff and they're preparing that staff and then of course of course consulting support so we see unfortunately we see the early signs of this but we also see the early signs of recovery so we're optimistic we think it's a good position to be in for our industry and we're looking forward to working with our customers a lot of CEOs and also CFOs watch our program is there a message that you wanted to they want to convey to them well I think to all those organizations we understand the cost pressures they're under we try and make your help you make your workforce as productive as possible we we look at ourselves as a variable cost for your organization but the payback for training for skills training and for selectively augmenting your team for critical projects is a vital part of the solutions that we can play for you and it's all on a variable cost basis so uh, we, we, uh, we I think we make great partners for our customers that, that's a really good message um, so one of the key things being a great partner uh, thank you again for being a sponsor and we really appreciate EduCorp training and consulting thank you, Tony we, uh, we appreciate being a part of your organization thank you sir thank you with me is Ryan Boswell with Dell Equal Logic good morning Brian good morning Ryan you are a feature presenter today what were the, some of the points that you touched on Really what we focused on this morning was uh, simplifying virtualization and, and how to do that, right? A lot of things around virtualization have been looked at as kind of being complicated. So really what we wanted to key in on was how do, how do companies go about this to develop not only a, a, a virtual strategy, but a business continuity and disaster recovery plan around it. So that was really the, the main focus of today's discussion. Now, a lot of people know Dell, and you guys are Dell Equal Logics. What, what is the difference there? Really, we're part of the Dell organization. It's one of the uh, subset products of the of the Dell portfolio. Oh, Ecologic was a company that was uh, purchased uh, by Dell about a year ago. It's a storage uh, device. It's really a virtual storage device. So what, what servers do on the virtual world where you're able to consolidate, we do the same thing on the storage side. So virtual projects, but also things like your backup strategies and, and other things. So it is a device that we actually sell to help organizations with these. For those people that weren't able to make it today, were there uh, one or two points, takeaway points that you would like to share? Uh, really, the, the key behind it being, you know, the, the reason that we're able to simplify storage, or excuse me, simplify virtualization for clients has been the ability to kind of create a cloud, uh, so to speak, on the stand to really simplify that process and make it as easy as possible to get into these environments without having to ask multiple times for different dollars.